What is up guys, it's Blades Gaming here with some more Pokemon Sword, and I decided I wanted to start off the episode with showing you guys um, how to get the Giga, Giga to Max Meowth, or the Dynamax Meowth gift. Um, you connect to the internet and go to Mystery Gift, and you should be able to collect it. So, I just wanted to show this on, on screen for you guys. So now we got Meowth on our team, I think? Maybe? <laughs> Yep, so let's go check out your party. Oh, I forgot a female meow. Okay. Fake out slash pay payday is really good to have her that lax nature. That's why your stats are like that. I was I was hoping it was gonna be lax, but it was. Yeah, now we got that uh, Dynamax Meow. Let me just say Dynamax because Gigamax sounds weird. And we're just gonna give like a little extra EXP for this battle just for Groupie. Unmarried ability. Oh, and it's level 5. I totally forgot that with like the new Pokemon games, now they tell you which moves are effective versus that Pokemon based on like, what moves you've used on it before and seeing like the type of reaction it's had. Oh, he likes he's, oh, he's really setting up like that, like he wants to check the shit out of Groupie, I can tell. <laughs> That was a nice level one, level five. Oh yeah, that's right. Shared EXP with everybody, so it doesn't even really matter like who I start the battle off with. Learn taunt. Wow, I'm actually surprised we learned taunt like that. Okay, we don't want to fight any Lulus. Um, what are you? Oh my god. A naked? What are you? A dark fire type? We gotta use poke to see if you're a fire type. Oh, you're not a fire type. <laughs> that would have been clutch, but I think I definitely want to add that onto my team. Next time I see it. Okay. Oh, and then when you pick up new items you haven't seen, it tells you what that item does. Okay, that's what's up. Okay, we got Leon's Charizard here. Can I go in here? One thing I'd normally do when I play Pokemon games, I go inside like every building just to see what I can do when I talk to people. Okay, but it looks like there's nothing really important to do there. We're just gonna go to the research lab and Leon's out here waiting for us. Well done, you've reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Lab. You did a far sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless with directions. See how your world has already grown and all thanks to having Pokemon with you? I know I'm sure glad I've got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the time. Now, in we go. Alright, alright, let's go, let's go. Let's get that Pokedex and Pokeballs. So I can go catch that Nicket. <laughs> I've got to give it to Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fascinating. Which Pokemon was that? Ah. It's like a Corgi, basically. An electric type, too. What is it today, Leon? Looking for more info on another never before seen super strong Pokemon? I wish you'd stop with these outlandish requests. I mean, are they really outlandish, though? Okay, she got a little pizzazz to her style. I see it on her shoes. Good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonia. What can I say about Sonia? Well, I like the way she cooks. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash. 
What kind of introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's assistant. This is Blades. He's a new Pokemon trainer. Set him on the right path, would you? Yep, please do, buddy. <sighs> what does he think I am? He's always got his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh, looks like you got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation tool. These. That said, Leon still gets lost, so... Oh, sorry, so tell me, do you know a lot about Pokemon? Uh, you already know. Well said. In that case, I'll make it so that you can use the Pokédex on your Rotom phone. Oh, what is it, like an application? Just so you know, that Pokédex is a gift from my Gran. Could you let Gran know that you've received the Pokédex? She lives in the house down along Rope 2. I mean, I can, but I also want to check out the lab. This is a very nice, nice looking lab. It's, it's kind of small. But that's a ton of books to be reading. But okay. Pretty decent. Looks like a lot to research actually happens here. But alright, let's go and thank um, her grant. Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop you. You just left the Pokemon lab, right? So that means you've got a Pokédex. I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. And you gave me a potion. It's a potion, so use it when your Pokémon's HP, their hit points, gets low. HP is like a Pokémon stamina. You can even use potions during battle. Knowledge is power. It's a good idea to talk to lots of different people and read everything you can on your journey. Which is typically what I do in most of my Pokémon games. Like, talk to this lady. <laughs> but actually, we get to look at the Pokédex. I almost forgot real quick. So, caught in scene 7. Scene 7 caught 2. So we got Squavit. Why does it say current recommendations, though? Okay, so Squavit, Rookity, Woolit, Nickit. Ah, it's a dark type. I, I find it interesting that it already has, like, their type on there. But I'm gonna I'm get that. <laughs> I'm gonna get uh, Nicket on the team. That'll be a nice early dark type to have. So we got Grookey when it when it uses its special stick to strike up a beat. That sound wave produces carrying revitalizing energy to plants and flowers in the area. All right. I still don't have Pokeballs though. At least I don't think I do. Oh no, I did get Pokeballs. I didn't even notice that. Oh, we got an adventure guide. Alright, you guys already know what that means then. That means we're gonna go catch that Nicket real quick. Just because uh, I want it on the team so I can get that EXP. Oh, bye. I could catch Rookity too, just because I also like seeing what the evolution for the bird type will be. I already know I want to get, um, Cor Corviknight? <laughs> but why? What's up with these levels? Level 6? Power tip. I'm surprised they didn't use Peck. Oh yeah. Now it used Peck. <laughs> I don't know why I did that one, I could have just pressed X. Alright, let's see if we can get that catch. Hey, first Pokemon caught, guys, rookity. Rookity's data will be added. It will bravely challenge any opponent, no matter how powerful. This Pokemon benefits from every battle, even a defeat increases its strength a bit. I mean, it kind of sounds like it should know Moxie. I don't even know what, uh... Oops, didn't mean to go to my Pokedex. I don't even know what ability it knows. Uh, 
Unnerve, okay. Oh, I must be, you must be like adamant. Oh, naughty. There we go. We got a naughty bird. All right, you're not who I want. It just went in the ground. Oh, there we go. There you are, my precious. Are you a girl too? I think I keep getting girl Pokemon. <laughs> it is. We're gonna use Scratch just so we don't get that extra stab effect. Oh wow. They really... They really made it hard with me, making it so I want to use like another attack, but I don't want to make it faint because it's already at a decent level. Okay, sweet. Level 9, level 6. Alright. Aided by the soft pads on its feet, it silently rates the food source of other Pokemon. It survives off its ill-gotten gains. Ah, so you're like a thief. That's why it kind of has, like, reminds me of, like, Swiper. I wonder if, like, the tears on its face are just supposed to be, um, like, it putting up a front. We're gonna swap you there. And just in case we have, like, a double battle or something, I still want Grookey in. But yeah, it's nice that we got, like, a dark type so early on. Don't worry, guys, I'm not gonna go for you. I kind of wanted to read that sign, but it didn't let me. Okay. Um, actually, wow, you can buy revives already? Wow, we got a lot of money. I'll say that. We'll buy five of you. I like to... I like to stay prepared, guys. I don't know, I feel like it, it only makes sense to, to have these. You guys are gonna be like, dang bro, you're already gonna get some revives? Heck yeah. I didn't know you could get them this early. Okay. It's actually pretty nice though. I was kinda hoping for, oh, never mind, the Pokemon Center's up there. <laughs> And I guess Hop is going to tell us about it. Got your Pokédex from Sonya? It is time to meet lots of different Pokémon and start building up a strong team. But battling strong Pokémon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way. Not to mention what battling another trainer could do. Luckily, we've got a Pokémon Center. Luckier yet, they're dead each to spot. They look the same wherever you go. Come on, Blake. Bet you've never been inside one. I mean, bro, do you think I've been living under a rock or something? I'm pretty sure I've seen one. It's right down the street from us. Level with me, Blaze. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? No, sir. Then I don't think you need me to tell you what you already know. If two kids are Pokemon trainers, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Cheers, I'm already good, though. I'm heading to Route 2. Come find me. Maybe when you're done here. Yeah, let me heal up my team. I'm kind of disappointed I couldn't buy Pokeballs from that, um, Pokemart right there, but I'm about to- Wow, that's a nice animation. <laughs> Yo, what- I don't know what that is on top of that. <laughs> Let's see if I can buy Pokeballs from this one. Nope. Okay. Got some Pokemon questions, feel free to ask. Wow, you can already remember and delete moves? That's convenient. This month's birthday horoscope is spot on. Huh, do you want me to tell you your fortune too? Yeah. Can you tell me the month? Um, uh, into your birth month. Yeah, I was born in April. 25th, I'm a Taurus. Let's see here. Hmm. What's the stain here? Oh, this must be from my snack. <laughs> this page is smudged and I can't really read it. <laughs> P 
people with your birthday are super duper lucky. You might even run into a legendary Pokemon, or maybe not. So anyway, see you later. Oh dang, and then she disappeared like that. I heard that Leon is your younger brother, I bet he's an amazing trainer just like Leon. Well, no, because I beat him. Oh wow, you can buy berries. That's also convenient. Because that means I can... That means I can give my Pokemon berries to hold. meant to give uh, but yeah we're not gonna give one to meow because I'm not really interested in leveling up that meow but it is just a good thing to have is that um, Dynamax meow Maybe I shouldn't have spent all my money because I totally forgot I can change up my look. <laughs> okay, yeah, because I kind of just want a hoodie. Okay, so I think I'm going to get the loose blue top. black hoodie I don't have black pants I can I guess I'll just wear white <laughs> I like how they call them skinny trousers So lame. <laughs> yeah, let me look at these backpacks though. <laughs> See, they got white and blue, but they don't have a, a black and blue I could have used. I like the knit cap more. Don't think I need sunglasses, but... It's kind of cold out here. Oh man, I forgot to equip those gloves. So I think I gotta go in here to put those gloves on. Wait, I already had blue ones? Dang, I wish I knew that before. I wouldn't have bought the black ones. <laughs> oh wait, did I even buy pants? I thought I bought new pants. I think I bought new shoes, I don't think I was disappointed with the shoes. But my boy low-key looking a little more fresh. A pokey doll. Okay, cool. Alright, I think I've wasted enough time. Like, I haven't even gotten to Route 2 yet, I think. <laughs> Listen, Blaze, I've been thinking, if you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try your hand for the gym challenge. The gym challenge, mate. The annual competition where trainers can battle it out for the right to challenge the champion. But the trick is that you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part, and Lee doesn't seem to think I'm up to snuff, so I'm thinking I'll talk to the professor and see if she can help. You've got to take part too. A proper rivalry is just the thing every trainer needs to keep going stronger after all. Keeps you motivated, right? 
The professor's house is way down at the end of Route 2, so let's head there and give our teams the chance to train up a bit along the way. I mean, I guess I'm fine with that, but I like to explore. <laughs> Sonia and Leon just have a healthy rivalry, but... But what, he beat her? <laughs> This guy's just awkwardly looking at him. Oh wow, that house all the way back there. Alright, at least we know where we're going. Over here, Blades. Okay, we finally made it to Route 2. Alright, Blades, it's time we filled in our teams a bit. I'm here to teach you how. You'll need to catch Pokemon if you got any hope in filling that Pokedex. Lee, where'd you come from? Oh, look at you, little place. You already caught some of your own. Your mom gave you those Pokeballs, didn't she? I'll give you some more Pokeballs in return. I'll let you to catch plenty of Pokemon. The Pokemon around here seem easy to catch, almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team, wouldn't you say? Dang, you gave me 20. You put the Pokeballs in your bag's Pokeball pocket. The Pokemon on your team will get EXP points when you catch Pokemon too. And of course, they get EXP points from battles, so take on the other trainers you meet along the path to help your Pokemon thrive. Your team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. But even I don't know exactly how yet. Show your champion something good, alright? Alright, I'm gonna catch loads of Pokemon. The professor will be shocked when she sees. I think this is like, if I don't see anything cool, I'll just catch Pokemon just to fill up the Pokédex. Yep, like, squirt it. <laughs> That tail looks actually pretty nice. Oh, uh, you know Quick Attack? But you also know Beat Up. So... Oh wow, you got a critical hit. It should hit like three more times. Oh, that's why it was two levels high. <laughs> you thought a dark move was gonna work? I think it's nice that it knows quick attack right off the bat like that. Yeah, what's up with this nigga getting crits? I like that. Now, let's see if this will work. <laughs> nope. Maybe I need to switch in on... Uh... Yeah, I'm definitely gonna switch in Gricky. <laughs> Just because I think the higher level Pokemon would definitely help Intimidate and to join. <laughs> See y'all with the games. Found throughout the Gala region, this Pokemon becomes even easy if its cheeks are ever completely empty of berries. Should be. Wait, what is that? A Chudo? What type are you? Again, I stay getting the, the females. Oh, okay, you're a water type. Okay, that's good. That means I can add a water type Pokemon to the team early on.
take one more quick attack and then I'll catch it. Hopefully it doesn't get a crit though. Okay, sweet. So far, I don't know how I feel about all these Pokemon design songs. They kind of look like derpy versions of another Pokemon. Like the Rickety, I think, is like an emo goth natural. Apparently the itch of its teething impels it to snap its jaw at anything in front of it. Okay. Wait, is that another Pokemon? No, this is just another Squirtle. <laughs> oh, we got a trainer battle. Let me see. Just because I like to, I like to be extra prepared. Uh, wow. Let's go, little boy. It's common manners for Pokemon trainers to battle when their eyes meet. <laughs> you were challenged by youngster Jake. I like how they take us into these battles. It's pretty epic. We don't use beat up because we got a full team, so this is actually pretty convenient too with the crits. Taking it that Nicked doesn't do well with physical attacks. But maybe you can, you can take some special attacks. Ooh, okay, shoot. Yeah, give me that level up. I earned it. Yeah, give me all your money, bro. Out of here. Those tips we already know. I'm just trying to see if like we'll interact with Pokemon we haven't seen before. Dang, they just got Pokeballs here for us to find left and right. Cute and strong together in combination. Last Lauren. Ah, uh, got a shooter. Okay, yeah, I'm probably about to do a split out and get Groofy in here. I didn't get any crits on that. I kind of wonder now if the dual typing for the final evolution for Groofy is going to be Grass Dark. We got level 10 with Ruby. Wow, did that Rookity learned home calls already? I think this is why they kind of... Why they kind of want you to catch these Pokemon early on. They're like giving them good movesets. 
Like, how do you already learn a home clause this early? And one thing about, like, your first playthrough for, like, these Pokemon games, I couldn't beat Hop, but I'm gonna beat you, is that you don't, you don't know, like, if you're gonna be over-leveled or under-leveled for these challenges, for these trainers and stuff, so I guess that's kinda why I don't wanna be like, what the? Wow. Oh, wow, this is like their version of, like, Caterpie. <laughs> now I gotta catch one of those and see what the heck it's all about. <laughs> Struggle zone? Wait, I'm Dark Cat, that's super effective. <laughs> Why am I out here? Oh, that's fine. You can have my special attack load all you want. Oh, damn. Yeah, we still don't know. Thought that was it, huh? <laughs> Yo, I low-key want to catch that Blit Bug and like switch it out with Meow, just to see its evolution, since you know Bug types evolve faster. Uh, I'm about to send out a Nickid. I think I'll send out Rookity just so we can see its battle animation. I don't know, I might keep Rookity on the team because blue's my favorite color and it's looking pretty nice. Yeah, blue's attack and accuracy. I'm surprised that they put that on it so early. That's fine, you should put attack, bro. That's all you got. Your quick attack's not gonna do anything. Mm. My boy Rickety out here. Ooh, does Nicket learn a move now? Nicket learned home claws too. What? <laughs> Yo. Lose to wild Pokemon, lose to many trainers. Oh, I'm sorry, bro. Which makes you any better, you was never gonna win from the start. Oh man, I wanna... Wait. Why does this have like that Super Saiyan aura on it? I don't know what's so different about this one. I don't know, I'm gonna catch this one just cause I saw it go like all Super Saiyan. I'll probably check it out later and see what the difference was. I don't know, what if this one has like a better nature than the one I have right now too? I'm really big into better natures and stuff for Pokemon. I don't know, but the Naked Eye now is just... I don't know, I kind of bonded with it already. <laughs> oh, that's why it knows Quick Guard. Ah, so when they're highlighted like that, that means that they know a special move. So it knows Quick Attack, Beat Up, Tail Whip, and Quick Guard. I'm not really using quick guard when I play Pokemon, but I'm cool with it from time to time. I don't think I'll use this one on my team unless it does have like a better nature. I don't know, but then like leveling it up is gonna suck too. <laughs> um, yeah, let's see your summary, bro. Are you lax? Yep, you're definitely going in the box. <laughs> I gained 140 W. Look, there's the professor. Oh, your professor old. <laughs> so have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness, no. The whole thing is still full of questions. I'd hope that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... 
Dear me, I'm sorry. I didn't even notice my guest. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. I'm glad you noticed we're young. We noticed you were old. Oh man, this just looks like an old person's house. <laughs> Why, Hop, dear, I see Wulu has made some new friends, and you must be Blades. I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonya. I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. You must already know about Dynamax, and right, Blades? Professor Ragnoli's been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years, and it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamax to the fullest. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about, too, you know? Like how many different types of teams there are. Hey Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? Hop and Blaze only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads they don't know yet. Dear, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Gala region become strong trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goes precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. He's like, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> right then, in that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. I should have gave my Nicket another Orenberry. <laughs> right, I'll be waiting outside. But okay, I still have time to give it another Orenberry. Oh man. Um, and just in case, just in case I end up having to use you in battle, I don't know why I would have to. And I just realized Meowth is holding something. Uh, we're gonna put that in. We received Repel. Alrighty, guys. So, I'm gonna end off this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. We added some new Pokemon to the team. Uh, we got Naked, Rickety, Squabbit and Choodle. Meowth doesn't really count because that was just the mystery gift I wanted to show you guys. But make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot. Also subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell to keep up with this Pokemon series. But guys, with that said, thanks for watching. Later.